Hi, my September 1st birthday babies. Come on in, because this video is all about you. Today, from the Secret Language of Birthdays book, I'm going to be reading you the personality profile for people born on your birthday. Now, this may reaffirm things that you already know about yourself, or it may challenge you to change some of those things which don't serve your highest good. Either way, just be open to the experience, because in the end, I'm going to give you advice from the book specifically for people born on your birthday. So let's get into it. All right, so September 1st is the day of no nonsense. September 1st people are tough and able to handle the difficulties fate has in store for them. They tend to be pragmatic, practical yet charming, with an approach to life that is straightforward and direct. Those born on this day often have quite spectacular fantasies, but demonstrate a knack for bringing such dreams down to the practical level, which can earn them a good financial return on their ideas. September 1st people do not fool around at all when it comes to their work. They resent any attempt to make light of what they do or to undercut their efforts. They are, however, capable of listening to constructive criticism, always interested in knowing how they can do something better. They are a bit perfectionistic and therefore open to suggestions for improvement. Though September 1st people are mentally oriented, they have a very physical side. Unless their physical needs are met through both appreciation and stimulation, they will be unhappy and frustrated. Combative types, they are ready to back up their words with actions and generally do not shrink from a fight. Thus, they must be careful not to steamroll those who may be a bit too sensitive for their direct onslaughts. So convinced are September, September 1st people of a person's need to stand up for him or herself that they may encourage their children or loved ones to learn a martial art or other form of self-defense. In every aspect of their lives, September 1st people seek a meeting of the mental and physical. If, for example, they plan a party or picnic, they like to roll up their sleeves and do the cooking or clean up themselves. In, if in business they think up an idea or a system, they won't be happy unless they implement and maintain it as well. No matter what they create, its physical manifestation is something in which they must be personally involved. Of course, sexual, satisf oh. of course, sexual satisfaction is important to September 1st people, but those born on this day require partner, partners whose mind they find at least interesting as their body. September 1st people must learn that not everyone thinks the way they do on this subject. Others may find it more comfortable to keep a clear distinction between mental and physical activities. This difference can cause misunderstandings with love partners. Furthermore, September 1st people may have to learn to be a bit less serious about their careers and not just restrict having fun to the weekend or vacation times. Those born on this day will find that many conflicts come their way. They are survivors, but have limitations too. Therefore, in some cases, they should not push past their luck, but rather be satisfied with what they have, including losses, and stop at the right moment. They must learn to walk away from ladies luck, wheel of fortune in order to avoid disaster, because their tendency to never give up is so strong they may have to learn this lesson the hard way. All right. So that was a pretty balanced uh, perspective here on people born on this day. Uh, let me give you a little advice from the book before we go. Learn when to quit, when to walk away, even when to run away. You might not be quite as powerful as you think you are, be guarded in dispensing advice. Try to cultivate a less serious aspect. Actively seek out and learn from others. Wow, that's really great advice for everyone. And I think you've got a lot that you can meditate on here. I wanna know if you're watching this because you're a September 1st baby or if you're watching this, if you're cross-watching it for maybe a partner or a parent, let me know in the comments. And let me know what struck a chord with you. What was the first thing that got you to think, wow, that's me. But more importantly, 
what was, if anything, the thing that you said, that's me and I should probably change that. Really curious to know. If you're watching this on your actual birthday, cheers to you. Happy birthday. And if you know someone whose birthday is coming up, comment below so that I can give them a shout out on their video. Or if their video is already up, go ahead and tag them or share the link with them so that they can be on this path of self-exploration and personal development with you. All right. Thank you so much for watching. Take care.